Hi everyone, I'm Laurencio and in this video I'm going to talk about all Dakar Rally games I found for Java. Dakar 2005 is a great game for the early game came out. I mean, sure, the game is basic for what we are used to on Java. You just drive on a straight road, no nitro, no significant obstacles, you just drive and take slight curves. It doesn't sound that interesting. But for that year, just having something to turn left and right was something. And the game has 6 tracks too, and it has 2 modes, exhibition races and rally, where you essentially do the same thing. The game isn't exciting, but it looks good and for the year 2005, it's a good game, for those standards. Dakar Rally 2006 is a great game for the year the game came out. It doesn't have that many modes, it has only exhibition races and championship, but hey, for that year, it's great to have a racing game on your phone period, yet alone a game that looks as good as this. In the game you have 3 vehicle types, cars, bikes and trucks, and you also get 10 tracks. The game packs a lot of content and the gameplay is pretty fun too. You have to collect repair kits or fuels to reach the end of the track. The game is great. Dakar 2007 switches the camera angle. Now you play from the driver's perspective. You still collect repair kits and fuel tanks, but this time the controls have changed. They might seem more simplistic, but you need to know when to brake and how to take a curb to not scratch the side of the road and lose speed. The game has 12 tracks, which unfortunately look almost the same. You could say that the game has actually just 2 tracks. And you get the same car. But with this game, it doesn't bother me. Because the gameplay is engaging. It's fun to play, and the game looks good too. Dakar 2008 changes the camera angle again, and thus a new gameplay emerges too. The controls feel so much smoother and you feel like having more control over the vehicle. The game also has high jumps now and the animations look gorgeous. Content wise you get the same car but in 4 different colors and multiple tracks that again can be reduced to just 2 distinct ones. But at least, these 2 distinct tracks are nicely made and offer a lot of fun. Dakar Rally Racing 2009 has some nice graphics, but the content is a little too scarce even for a 3D Java game. The game has only 2 tracks and 1 single car in different colors. You can have the same car in red, yellow or blue. Content wise, the game is disappointing. At least the game has some decent game modes. You have exhibition races, time attack and championship. It's decent. But since the content is so scarce, you can imagine the championship mode how it is. As for the controls, they feel like a mix between Rally Stars 3D and VRC FIA. But they tend more towards Rally Stars meaning that the car physics are springy and you feel like driving a cardboard cart rather than a hunk of metal with an engine. Even so, if the game had more content, it would have been more fun. But since there are only two tracks and one car and the gameplay doesn't impress, the game is hard to recommend. Dakar 2010 hasn't improved much over last year's game. The upside is that now you get two different cars, instead of just one car in different colors. But in rest, you still can say that you get only two distinct tracks, which this time don't look as good, because the background doesn't always match with the 3D game. The only impressive part about the game are the 3D graphics. But graphics alone can't make a good game. You need content too, which here is kinda lacking. Two distinct tracks and two distinct cars isn't much when compared to other 3D Java games. At least it's got the norm in game modes. It gets exhibition races, time attacks and championship mode. It's decent there. But in rest, there are better rally games on Java. Still the game remains impressive because it's 3D and any 3D Java game is usually impressive. Okay, so this was the video. If you liked it, please hit the like button and subscribe. If you want to financially support me in my pursuit to review as many video games as possible, you can do that on Patreon or on the channel's membership section. You will help me a lot. If you want, you can follow me on Twitch, Instagram or Discord. 
And if you want to see another video of mine, just wait till I stop talking and there will be thumbnails of other videos I've made. Thanks for watching.